Sometimes you hear people refer to bats and flying foxes as dirty animals when really that couldn't be any further from the truth. Bats spend an awful lot of time grooming, a little bit like cats really, cleaning their fur and keeping themselves clean and making sure their wings are in perfect condition for flight. The wings are strong and supple but the skin on them is also quite sensitive. It's a little bit like the skin of your eyelid. And when they groom they actually oil their wings and make them waterproof. In their wing membrane they have these tiny little lipid deposits and as they push their nose against their wing when they're grooming the membrane gets stretched and these lipid deposits get released and also they've got sebaceous glands in their muzzle that release a bit of oily substance as well and they use these to spread oil across the wings to lubricate the wings and make them waterproof. They also lick and scratch their fur and using their feet as cones. Mothers also spend a lot of time grooming their babies, going all over them to keep them clean. And this even continues when they're up to six months old and flying independently, but they still come back to mum for a clean and a cuddle and a bit of milk. So grooming also serves a social function as well as a bonding exercise. Babies also have this interesting reflex where if you stroke them down the side, just under their wings, they'll automatically spread their wings right out, which is what their mothers do when they want to clean under their wings. Grooming also seems to be socially contagious when one bat in a group starts grooming. They all start doing it at once. So that's kind of interesting to watch too. <laughs>